Colin Kaepernick's decision to take a knee during the national anthem in protest of police brutality and the lack of accountability that uh, faces police officers after they have unjustly shot unarmed black men. And we know a lot of different cases of this. Probably the worst, maybe, well, it's one of the worst, but Eric Garner's case is always one of the worst that I've seen. It's a pretty scary one, but <laughs> essentially, because of that, his career was mauled. Obviously, there's this collusion case going on now, and it looks like he's actually made some progress, so that's good. It's very obvious there's collusion going on, because if you look at the quarterback quality level in the NFL, it, it's at a low in a long time. There are a lot of shitty second stringers, sometimes even starters, man. They're really bad. So the idea that Kaepernick can't even get a third string backup or a second string backup position is one of the most laughable claims on the entire planet. Um, and maybe he even would qualify for a starting position. I'm not really sure. But Nike decided to make a pretty bold move, I have to say. I really do have to say. They decided to start this new ad campaign with uh, it being headlined by Colin Kaepernick. Uh, now, <clears throat> this was a really big move. I was actually really surprised because this is the most polarized debate I've ever seen in the country, for me personally, uh, that I've seen. Just, you know, all around, wherever it be in the political sphere, definitely is the most polarized debate I've ever seen. And so, for Nike to decide to take a stance... That's a pretty big deal, man. And I mean, that's a really big thing because Nike's probably the biggest athletic brand there is, I think. I'm pretty sure. And so there have been conservatives who are now burning their Nike wear, which is always hilarious because it's like, dude, you paid for those things. You're just going to waste your, you're just wasting your money. And it's pretty laughable. But Donald Trump has came out talking about uh, Nike's decision and he said that it's a quote terrible message uh, <laughs> which is pretty funny I think that the irony of Donald Trump calling anybody else's message a terrible message is hilarious now obviously there's been a history of what Donald Trump has been doing we know about his you know at the rally there was the whole big thing that happened uh, of him saying that you know he wishes that NFL owners would just go out to these sons of bitches and, you know, fire them right up front for kneeling during the national anthem. But I just, I just find it so hilarious that, of all people, Donald Trump is the one saying that somebody's sending a bad message. This guy, <laughs> the dude who launches these crazy personal attacks, essentially on a daily basis, is trying to tell someone else who has, uh, you know, that they have a terrible message. I find that hilarious. I mean, the irony of that is, is really, really unmatched. And it's pretty tough to top something like that. It really is pretty tough to top something like that. But I will say this. Really, a lot of props to Nike. A re really a lot of props. I was really surprised because for them to take this risk, it's a really big deal. Because they have to make this calculation in their business. And I guess they came to the conclusion that they can do this. It's a superbly polarizing issue. And so I'm really surprised and shocked that such a big corporation would decide to make this move. But hey, man, I, I appreciate it. I don't like you guys making your shit in sweatshops. But I mean, I guess this is a good move. Um, I'm glad they're supporting Colin Kaepernick. I support Colin Kaepernick. I hope that he wins his collusion case because he should. They're obviously colluding against him because the quality of quarterback play in the NFL is at a low in, in some years. And he somehow could not land a third or second string job as a QB, which doesn't make any sense because he took a team to the Super Bowl and an NFC championship. So there's no, no reason, no reasoning for that whatsoever.